hello guys welcome back to with hero tips in this video i'm going to talk about how to fix windows update error 80072efe how to fix it sir so first thing you have to go to run you have to go to search and you have to type for run command open this and give services dot msc services dot msc now press ok ok so this is how it looks now uh, from here you have to uh, scroll down a little bit uh, you have to scroll down and you have to select background intelligent transfer service uh, you have to uh, select this background intelligent uh, transfer service you have to right click on this uh, you have to double click then from here you have to change this to automatic uh, once you have to change this to automatic you have to go for apply and go for ok right and once after that uh, it is done you will be getting a restart option here so go for a restart and see whether the issue is solved or not if it's not working uh, if it's not working uh, then we will go for the next one so here I am changing back to the same because I am not having an issue so you have to follow the instruction so once after trying this if it's not working then we have to go to method 2 so the method 2 is you just have to go to uh, following one this is you just have to open your file explorer then go to local disk C now from here you have to click on uh, windows and from here you have to go for software distribution you have to go for uh, software distribution you have to select this and delete all these files you have to delete all these files and once after deleting all these files try to restart your windows pc on safe mode and see whether the issue is solved or not if it's not working then we have to go for the next one so next one is the same as what we have done you just have to uh, you know you just have to type here so we close this you just have to go to run once again i'm showing for uh, for some of you guys you don't get to confuse it so type run and give services uh, dot msc press ok and now from here you just have to select uh, this one so you just have to uh, scroll down a little bit and uh, scroll down a little bit and from here you have to select uh, you just have to scroll down a little bit and you have to select okay so guys i just got confused in between don't worry you just have to click on cryptographic services i mean you just have to double click on this as you can see that the cryptographic uh, services is on automatic so what you have to do is you just have to disable this here once after disabling you just have to uh, stop this and once after that go for apply this is what you have to do and after doing this you just have to close this uh, then you just have to go back to uh, the file explorer and click on local disk C and now from here once after doing this you just have to select windows and from here you have to select system 32 you have to uh, select system 32 and from here you have to delete a folder named cat root 2 you just have to delete this folder and if it's not possible to delete while trying to delete what you have to do is you just have to restart your pc on safe mode and once after that you just have to delete the respective folder you just have to release uh, delete the respective folder and after that you just have to go back to the services and you have to select the cryptographic services again you just have to select this and now we just have changed it to automatic right now you just have to uh, change this to uh, automatic you just have to change this to automatic because we made disabled in the last time so now change this to automatic and once after that go for apply and after apply go for stop after apply go for stop and like i said you'll be having a restart service over here just go for restart right and uh, most probably the issue will be fixed and even after trying all these steps it's not fixing you don't have to worry I'll be trying all these things if it's not working then you don't have to worry so I'll be giving one link in the description which is uh, Microsoft update catalog where this will take you to this so now from here you have to download the respective one on your uh, PC and I suggest for uh, the 64 base system you can go for this you just have to right click on this 
and now from here you just have to check for further details and package details and you just have to go further and you have to delete it in between so you can also go for download option just have to download and install this and see after that most probably the issue regarding update error 80072EFE will be completely fixed and I hope this video is helpful for you guys and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications see you soon in the next video peace out Thank <laughs> you.